Hello and welcome to the Daytona the, Day the Daytona race of NASCAR AI Championships. Today we are watch you will be joining us on a beautiful day here in the Daytona track. We will be having 10 laps and here it starts off now and it's number 23 in P1 here number 6 violet violet defense in P2 uh, Carvana 84 peak 12 FedEx 11 uh, we get circle 31 and 21 motocraft all the way at the back now the championship will be based off numbers here this is number 23 going three wide with 12 and six here defending 12 first six almost gets t-boned six is t-boned by 12 who is now in p1 there he is getting pushed down to the wall number 23 in the fray of it 84 has been pushed off the track and 23 joins back in the race right beside sunny d as we see number 12 go ahead with uh, getting p1 from 23 there it's now fedex trying circle and napa there six third uh six um 31 and 11 they're going three wide a bit there fed fedex 11 going trying to go on the outside of 12 will he make the move as sunny d tries to squeeze himself in the middle there it's a big crash there this circle 31 off the track after a napa pushes him off napa number nine he almost hits the 23 of um, of uh, what? How did he end up at the front? And it's 23 ending up at the front of the group here, fighting with 11 and 15. Sunny D pushing 11 off. There it is Napa number nine, the one who pushed stop circle 31. There, all of it, all of them going five wide. 23 losing his grip as he goes into the grass having to go sideways there leaving the 4 11 15 9 and 12 12 has conceded his position there that we're closing to get to lap 12 giving his uh, giving 11 a push as he gets draft as well 15 being left a little behind here as we watch 23 right behind motorcraft who has actually been kept uh, keeping it clean for majority of the race there is lap 2 as we see Sunny D and Napa number 9 and 15 lose a lot of their grip there here it is FedEx in the 11 20, 12 peak going down the turns here so far so good it's number 9 looking to get the edge there he is he goes down the inside of 12 trying to get 12 uh trying to get p2 there uh 15 joining in the fray side by side with 12 trying to squeeze himself right behind 11 they're getting the draft as nine goes side by side down the inside not looking very well for 11 here as if he wants to keep p uh p1 there sunny d joining it in as well going down the inside number 15 12 hits 11 as and nudges him off p1 trying to take his position uh, trying to get p1 away from a nine there it's 11 not finding a place where to go here trying to squeeze himself there it's 15 uh, ultimately p1 p2 11 p3 9 p4 12 as they are all fighting it there it is 11 looking to squeeze himself down the inside he's on the inside line but does not make the move as Napa number nine gets some draft going down the outside. Will we be looking at an uh, four here? There it is. Sunny D loses his. Uh, oh, and he goes T boned by number nine here of Napa. 23 getting hit by 15. 15 just gathering it along as we see 11 and 12. Now at the front 11 looking to squeeze him out and whoa what did we see here it was if i'm not right yeah it's number 23 and 15 
going the wrong way around as they are going the opposite way around you. Number 84, not far back behind the first three. Now it's 11 in P1. 12 is Peak, who's go who goes down the who goes down the inside. Number nine Napa, trying to find a way there. 11 trying to defend his position, pushing 12 out of the way. 12 just gets the inside line there, and there it is. He takes P1 away from 11. As we see, 11 has been left in the dust a bit there, with 12 trying to gain some speed, split himself from the group. As we see, um, Sunny D uh, and 23 uh, McDonald's have been left slightly behind Carvana Circle. As we see here, it's number 12 starting lap 4 of the race. Napa looking down the middle, trying to get that edge. Here he is down the middle as uh, number 11 goes high. 12 does go low here. Who will come up? He won as 12 is holding his position quite well, trying to block. Uh, middle section there and FedEx number 11 joins them there in a long draft line here it is going down the back stretch uh, past turn 2 here it's 12 in P1 9 P2 as 9 pulls down high to get the to possibly make a move 12 just loses a bit of grip 11 now in head it ahead of every uh of 12 down the middle as he shifts down to low side of the track here number nine napa kind of squeezed in there as 12 closes him off trying to keep his position what defending we're seeing from 12 here about to start lap 5 of 10 and it's amazing race this is as number nine is not far behind looks down the outside or the high line with FedEx 11 not uh, just behind them going side by side with Peak 11 nudging Napa ahead as he goes down the high line again it's Napa now forced down to the middle line and FedEx in a horrible position getting squished a bit to the wall there Peak still holding uh, uh, P1 here for a while it's lap 5 and here it is 3 wide and we see Circle Carvana, Motocraft also doing the same. Almost Sunny D have not have not even started. Uh, we see Violet Defense um, not being really a competitor in this race as they were playing it safe throughout the race. There, number 23 far behind after that horrible crash. Number 11 gone off the track here. What happened to him as he goes straight into the wall? leaving number 9 and 12 to duel it out it seems to be a mechanical failure from his side there there it is parking by the side and he is out of the race either it was a brake failure failure or whatever but uh, it, sh it seems to be very um, big as he it's now only peak and Napa up ahead Napa going the down, getting the draft here. They're about to start lap six, four more laps to go. Number nine down the high uh, line here, and joining in the middle with number twelve, a little nudge. And there it is, twelve holds P1 for the longest time I've seen. As we see number nine not far behind him, trying to get that draft. Let's see the if we can see um, Fed, FedEx number 11. Yeah, he's just running himself into the wall. Seems to be his car won't, won't turn off. Um, circle kind of pushed off here by Carva Carvana number 84. And we come back to the leaders. Which is num number 12, still number 12. Number 9 looking down the high line, almost getting squished into the wall. Takes P1. Will he hold it on for a long time? 
as number 12 will be looking to make a move it's lap six about to be lap seven not not long yet um at three and a half laps to go here it is number 12 just losing p1 but um i'm sure he will be fighting a little lock up from napa there number nine uh, gives 12 an advantage as they go down the middle and about across the line still in first place it's lap 7 three more laps to go number 9 just holding it out trying to make uh, trying to get the advantage back after losing it from that um, lock up and he goes down the low side number 12 forcing to get the draft as nine covers him up number 12 looking a bit down the inside there he's, he's looking at it giving it a look but he ultimately tries to stay behind number nine here get the draft done and there it is that's two cars out it's a circle and uh, circle and FedEx by the looks of it yep uh, now circles out as well a mechanical failure same in the same place as well very uh, uh, coincident uh, that's a very co coincidentally uh, a coincidence um, here it is number nine now in P1 peak looking to take back before lap eight does not get enough joy does get a little push there and it's nine in the lead now in lap eight both circle and um number 11 uh, 31 and 11 are in their own world uh number 12 going down the middle now trying to push nine off the line but it's not working out it's eight laps now eight laps nine has hold it out a lot a long time here here you go passing the cars of 11 and 31 circle fedex as we see 12 make the move down the inside on the back stretch penultimate lap is next lap here as we see 12 and 9 are fighting it out let's watch some of the battles back here it's number 21 motorcraft trying to get the p uh, trying to get p3 uh, they have been playing it safe majority of this race uh but um yeah p3 would be amazing for them as they're not really competitive most of the races we've seen here this carvana going down 84 number 84 going down the uh, inside getting p3 here top three does get points number three gets one point number two or p2 gets two points and number one gets three points in the championship here he will be crossing the line lap 9 penultimate lap next lap is last lap the white flag as Carvana is looking to grab the uh, the points there number one point uh, number three points uh, which is only one point motorcraft not allowing him trying to go down the outside here but 84 defending quite well motorcraft looking to get those points as they are not competitive from some of the friendly races I've seen it's now Motocraft getting the draft from Carvana and look it looks like they might make a move down the last few corners so we saw some lockups up there by um, number nine there they seem to be getting a lot of lockups this race it's 21 going down the inside of 84 eight how will 84 react barely any defense from 84 here 21 gets p3 for now as they have the inside line here uh the low line here um here it is it's, uh carvana 84 now he does not get any points if he stays p4 that's why he's fighting back here trying to get that p3 and they will be crossing the line this is an ultimate lap and there it is number one and two three and four have crossed the line to start the last lap the white flag of the race it looks like the, the the front runners have slowed down a bit let's see 
who will end up in P1 here. It's number nine holding his position out there. 20, uh, 12 at the back, trying to get a bit of draft, it, but it, it seems like he will be trying to make the move last minute. Um, which m might be a good idea or might not as um, it is the last few corners of the race here it's 12 making the move just before turn 3 down the inside going low and shifting slightly to the to the middle trying to push Napa to the wall there number 9 Napa and they are going to uh, turn 4 here real close <coughs> down the main straight and here it is nearing turn 4 and it seems to be number 12 who wins here in Daytona and let's see who ends up in and there it is it's a photo finish from Motocraft there and Carvana it looks to be Motocraft ahead of Carvana who claims P3 that will be some good points for them and the rest have not crossed the line yet but thank you for joining us here in Daytona